how she traveled. And our women who made a difference. A cooler kids gift to our community. The first of the firsts, Nellie Souls, as portrayed by Alex. Being the first is demanding, nerve-wracking, but also a little thrilling. I was the first woman to run for assembly of the first district on the La Crosse County ticket. My interest in politics was strong, yet I was afraid of being criticized and threatened. I didn't know how the community would react because I was the first woman to run for a political position. I felt this was important that I ran because women were not recognized then, and I felt I could change that. I announced my ticket on April 17, 1932, not knowing what would happen. I promised to work for the public interests and my belief in progressive principles. I put that out there and hoped for the best. The morning of the election, everyone was yelling and cheering, and as I went by, I thought I heard some threats. I couldn't be sure, but I got out of there fast. It was unnerving that people would do this. I guess it's just a part of life. It ended up that after the election, I only got third place out of five candidates running. All were males, except myself. I guess lacrosse just wasn't ready for a woman in assembly. That only pushed my interest in politics further. I write about every single president. My favorite was John F. Kennedy. Since I like to braid rugs and need a point fabric, I sent a braided rug to JFK while he was in office. I don't know if he ever got it or not, but I feel special that I sent a handmade gift to my favorite president. My main interest has always been in politics. Like I said, being the first is demanding and nerve-wracking, but that doesn't mean you give up. You keep yourself going, and the rest will come. This podcast brought to you from La Crosse, Wisconsin by the Cooley Kids at Longfellow Middle School in conjunction with the League of Women Voters.